Hey guys, it's Julia and welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys like a quick little update and also some of my recent reads. So I've been away for a bit and like we don't have to talk about all the reasons. Um, I just feel really shitty about this channel and like what it was and then how dead it is now. And I know that's really my fault, but at the same time, it, it just it feels weird. So I feel a little weird sitting in front of the camera today. <laughs> uh, I've been spending like all my time on Twitch in terms of like the time I used to put into YouTube, it's been just going into Twitch. So if you wanna like see me like three times a week or something, definitely go over there. And like, I'd be happy to chat with you guys and play games with you over there. But today we're gonna talk about some of the books that I've read in the past little bit. Uh, I have five here to talk about. First I have here is a manga series and this is called I Am A Hero. So this one I read volumes one and two. These guys actually got on sale. That's why the, like I've had them for a bit. I got them on sale. That's the reason why I own them. But they are zombie mangas. Uh, you know, like apocalyptic zombie horror is what these are. Our main character is this dude on the cover here and he makes a lot of questionable decisions. He's uh, the back described him as mentally unhinged. So I really didn't like him throughout these first two volumes. Like the first one, he was just like a creepy asshole that we were following. So like it wasn't really a great time. But in the second one, we saw a little bit of character development. Just just a little. So uh, there's more dynamics and more relationships in this one and like the series is clearly going somewhere. So there's like, this is volumes one and two and this is three and four in the bind ups. But I definitely would continue with this series if I could find the third one for a good price. Uh, if not though, probably not. But <laughs> I really like the art style in it. I'll show you guys art from the first one. Yeah, I really, I really like the art style in this one. I end up giving the first one like a three, three star rating, like wasn't that great. But if you, if you have them or you think it sounds interesting and you could get to the second one, I think the second one is a little bit better. So uh, if I get a hold of the third one, I'll definitely let you guys know my thoughts on that one. But they're really fun to read. They're really fast reads. I like horror manga like a lot. So it, like I didn't have a bad time reading them at all. I'm giving this one like a little bit over like a three star rating because it was, it was better, but yeah. <laughs> Next up here, I have Fence Volumes 3 and 4. This series is about like an academy of fencers, all male fencers, and they compete and they're trying to get on this team. That's what like the whole series is about. So we follow each like the fencers and their dynamics, their relationships, their rivalries, their competition, their uh, romances a little bit. So there's lots of stuff happening in this series. I really, really like it. I can't wait to read the next volume. It's so, so good. <laughs> I think it's just really interesting too to see like a bunch a bunch of people that are all talented just trying to prove their place and I really like sports graphic novels surprisingly. I want to read that hockey one that is out as well that like he's a baker too I think but so good. If you're interested in fence at all I'd recommend checking it out. I never thought I'd really care to read a book about fencing but it is so good like so good so I gave both of those four stars each because they were Beautiful. Lastly, I read I Hope This Reaches Her in Time by R.H. Sin. This was a reread for me. I was going through a little bit of a rough time and, uh, you know, reading poetry in bed <laughs> when I'm really sad kind of kind of helps me feel a little seen. So that's what I was doing when I read this one, just crying in bed reading this. <laughs> but it was it was very good. I, I, I really like R.H. Sin's work. Um, you know, he just focuses on trying to like just let you know your worth and he gives like a lot of motivational quotes obviously a lot of motivational poems but his story like his poems usually are about like love loss relationships and then like that kind of thing also like some of them are more focused on breakups but this one was more this one was more about like sadness and love and relationships these are also this one is also really inexpensive like i think you can get the ebook for like really really cheap if you've never read rh sim before i definitely recommend reading something by him um i've read mostly everything he's come out with unless there's been like some new like i, I don't think i've read his most recent stuff uh that's come out in like the past like six months but other than that i've read everything he's put out and i highly recommend him for especially like beginner people who want to get into poetry uh for modern poetry like i think his is pretty good and i would recommend checking him out so there you guys have it those are some of the books that i've been reading uh thank you so much for watching this video i know it was short 
definitely let me know videos that you would like to see in the future because like I don't want to stop uploading on this channel and the reason why I haven't been is mostly um, me shitting on myself so I've had some people come into my Twitch chat and say they really miss my videos and some people tweet me and message me so thank you guys so much if you message me or just watch or care about my videos at all like I really really appreciate it and I honestly like yeah I'm just like self-sabotage I'm like Julia you suck why would you upload a video like you're no one gives a fuck no one no one cares and your videos aren't gonna do as well as they used to um so like that's kind of what my mentality has been which is why I haven't been uploading but if you stay till the end of this video I fucking love you thank you and I hope to be back with a new video soon